could get a million dollars right, right now. now. Yeah. Hi, beautiful people. It's Lou here, and I'm back with another video. And today, we're going to talk all about manifestation. Uh, thank you for... Oh I was going to say we're going to talk about manifestation with Lena, but mm. since she... <laughs> y'all know what's up already y'all know women so i don't even have to introduce myself i have yeah. no guests here i'm home baby so home y'all know what's up it's her house but, <laughs> but anyways we're gonna talk all about manifestation and how you guys can manifest in our stories because y'all this is real it is real real like yes manifestation the universe mm -hmm. is but before Israel. we get started don't forget to like comment and please subscribe, subscribe. because we're manifesting i am subscriber <laughs> yes yes so we are. we're speaking it into existence 1k by the end of the summer definitely both of us and that's on who that's Period. on the universe baby <laughs> and thank you to everyone who's who has subscribed already and let's just get right to the video yes i started manifesting things mad long ago but then i just she told me about this book which you guys need to read everybody needs to read it like y'all need to read the Ooh, secret twins mine look dusty crusty but don't <laughs> mind it i haven't I or you can watch it. the documentary on For netflix years. because it gives you a lot of insight and it's very detailed about how you can manifest because this video is just gonna be a little short like so you could practice but everybody should get this book this book literally should be next to your bible to be honest this book have changed my life in so many ways honestly i've been reading this book for like three years now someone mentioned it to me when i was going through some tough time and that that been my best friend since then so manifestation will it. literally change your life i feel like it's okay it's the law of attraction which is it's it's just there like you know it's just a it's just like the law of gravity like the books the book talk about it it's like the law of gravity like if you throw something up it's gonna come down you know yeah. so if you draw something to you, to you it's gonna, it's come, gonna to come to you, to you because like, it's a natural law nobody can change it because it's here you know it's yeah it's here for you it's just like um I bet everybody watched this movie, Aladdin, when he got the, um, what is it called? The blue thing? Oh, yeah, the, the, wi the, the wizard, the whatever that was in the little. <laughs> Isn't it the little magic potion? Not magic ah, potion. Nah. What is it called? The Danny. <laughs> Jenny. <laughs> the genie in the bottle. Yes. Oh my God, the Danny. What the fuck? <laughs> the Jenny, the magic potion. Okay. <laughs> But yeah, it's like the Jenny. You know, like how the Jenny, whenever like Aladdin wiped the little whatever that thing name is, and he asked for like wish, like the Jenny always grant him the wish. It's just like that's the universe. Like as long as you as the universe and you be patient for it and you believe, you truly believe in it, it's literally gonna come to you because the universe is here to give you what you want mm -hmm. but you just have to believe it first like that's literally the first thing like if you don't believe you might say it you might speak it into existence but if it's not here you don't truly believe it yeah. it's just like it's not gonna happen so mm -hmm. that's true and it's like i feel like a lot of people won't understand it so the most basic way is basically what you think about is what you get like I feel like before you start manifesting, try to look back um, from your past yes. and see like what has been happening to you. And you could see what you've been thinking. Or you could just try it overnight. Like you could think of something very detailed and literally you will see it. Like I feel like you have to be really specific, really detailed. Yeah, that's and, one thing too. And like you manifest when you want to see it, like the exact date, the exact time, the exact you time, see and it. you it will come to you at the exact mm -hmm. moment. It's basically whatever you're thinking is what is gonna come to you. And I feel like we've been really conditioned to think about a lot of things, you know, like um, 
like our life our whole life we've been conditioned to think about things and that's basically what has been happening to us like ba how we were raised and like what we're what we believe in and that that's what we are pulling towards Toward, us yeah and also one thing i feel like when um whoever like start manifesting first um manifesting i really will recommend you to start meditating mm -hmm. because i feel like meditation really help you to control your thoughts like because like another you know like how many thoughts you have another mm -hmm. you like have like six trillion something so if you can control what you're thinking like to not think like negative stuff because like whenever you think like negative it impact your life mm -hmm. you should always i know like it's not like 100 percent like you're not gonna always be positive but as long as you try that's all that matters try to stay positive so that's i feel like meditation yeah. that's how you can control your thoughts to stay positive so and it sounds like a lot like controlling every thought that you get but i feel like the more you do it the easier it gets yeah. like literally also when i say controlling your thoughts i don't mean like oh if for example you have like other idea you're like oh no i'm not gonna do that. <laughs> like no just like you know like take a deep breath try to relax and then mm -hmm. try to think i i try to think about something that make you happy instead of you thinking about that negative mm -hmm. thought and then right away when you start thinking about that positive thing it's gonna sh your brain's gonna shift apart like from the negative thought so now you're gonna fix your eyes on the positive side so that's how you start to change mm -hmm. and because basically the more positive you thoughts you think the more positive, positive that will attract. come to you yeah. and like basically all the negative that are still coming to you is because of people around you and like things that happen like we, we go on social media and we see like a lot of things are happening and obviously that's gonna affect you even if you're being positive as much as you want you're gonna see these things and you're gonna get angry but you have to shift your focus because you have to remember like you have to stay positive because you thinking negative is not it's just adding to it and making everything more negative so it, it's not helping and i be feeling bad now now that i know the secret and now that i know like um manifesting and thinking positive like when i see something i'd be like i'd be because now i don't really like um focus how do you say it? being sympathetic or empath I don't empathetic know. yeah with other people like yeah, you know when somebody's talking talking about something they're that trying they're going to, through yeah like or you should feel sad for them yeah yeah like. so and the minute you are in that position with that person so like their energy is just like affecting you to so you. now you start having like some thoughts that's like Eat, mm -hmm. like the same now, level mm -hmm. as them so you literally lower your vibration and i'd be feeling bad now that i'm i can't like it's not like i can't do it but i try to avoid it like if i see something negative i try to be positive but you know a lot of people will think like oh why are you do like you know like obviously if something really bad happens to someone we're yeah, human and we're gonna feel bad but i feel like when you don't feel bad and when you try to bring positive people don't like that because they feel like you're not being Me since you're not yeah, or not you're not taking it serious yeah or as trying to like, relate but you fe feeling bad doesn't mean like you're taking it serious that's though. what so i'm saying i don't like when people say that but you know like it's human that's human being that's what they even with to. even for a lot of the things that are happening like you know they're killing a lot of people obviously we're supposed to be upset about it but me being angry all the time about it is not gonna help yeah anything. that's just you know so why can't i me try to be positive and Instead. like if everybody was positive like a lot of the things wouldn't be happening and i know a lot of people don't believe that like mm -hmm. i talk to a lot of people and they all think we're crazy because yes. they really don't believe it because they're like this, what about this what about that but you need to take all that yeah, out of like your all head. those negative Everything. things like I, I like all those negative stuff i bet if you think deeper there's something positive into it we also try to play the um play this game that's one thing you guys can do mm -hmm. like for example um i give i give her like a sentence like a word i'm like okay what can you what positivity can you take out of this word for example if i say um anything mm, a car accident mm -hmm. what's positive about it like new opportunities like um and you, you should be grateful like even if you get into an accident like 
it, it wasn't bad like you're still alive you know you have a new you can you have a new start basically yeah. and you get to be grateful and you get to like see another side i feel like I, there's always something positive that can yeah come so out that's of it. what i'm trying to say like there's like whatever negative is happening like there's something positive mm -hmm. coming out of it no matter what like you might not see it right now but eventually in the future or maybe like three months or mm -hmm. six years later you like think about it oh my god like that thing had a positive silence to it so you guys always need to think like yeah even though that's bad right now but like try to like take it yeah, on another like, way you know like just mm -hmm. like they say rewind it back like with everything that is happening obviously it's bad like if people are getting killed um by police but now it's in the light like we we're all seeing it and we could do something about it like before all these things were still happening, still happening yeah they were worse ago. they yeah. were worse but nobody what nobody but had a now because of social it. media yeah nobody there was out, no platform you know? where you could share things to where everybody sees it you know the world is not getting worse the world is and i i, I actually just got to this part too but um everything exists right now the past the future and the present energy don't die energy and even mm -hmm. in science class we all learn this that's the first thing we learn and in science class, class. Yeah. energy just take another that form is, yeah it does not die like even if you die your energy does not die because nothing energy cannot die and that's literally with everything like every creation from energy to energy like we didn't have tvs before because the energy wasn't transformed but the energy to make the tv was something else, else. in the past and now somebody thought of it and Had now it came idea, out so. and it transformed and like literally i was just thinking about it like in the future we really could have everything we really could have flying cars, cars yeah. because it's all energy and what it, it all comes from our head and all we have to do is think about it transform it because that's all it is mm -hmm. you know so once you manifest something don't keep dwelling and don't keep mm -hmm. like okay how come it's today it's not here yet how come? Mm -hmm. like no give it time like it's a process guys like don't expect it to come like why the second you ask for it no but just be patient and you know it will come one example i can give for example that just happened this morning last week i posted um a video my fashion nova home i call her before i posted i was just like yo watch this i before i posted that video i manifested i say one week from now this video gonna reach 1k views and this morning when i wake up i i whenever i wake up after i meditate and my write down what i'm grateful for and stuff like that i check my youtube and social media in general and i check that one video because it made today make it exactly one week and i check it it says 1.2k views i was just like I, it's not that it was a surprise because i know what i manifest mm -hmm. for that i know so it's exciting. coming to me it was just so exciting and i was just like oh my god it happened like mm -hmm. i believe it so obviously it's gonna happen so that's one example so you have one you i have, have a lot, lot. <laughs> <laughs> i literally been manifesting everything even her literally like i always tell her yeah. that because everything that i want i usually like even Get before it. i knew about manifestation i would pray for it and i would just like you know that's that's what i want and then it just happened but um you can tell the one about your the room that you wanted for your school by yourself and oh then, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's crazy that's funny okay so since like i go to school i go away for school and last year the past two semesters um i had a roommate for the first two weeks of school but then she got her room by herself and she left so i've had the room for a year and then um next for the next year i was so worried about like having, having a, roommate. a roommate it's not like i i <laughs> it's so funny but it's not like i don't like people but like i don't know i'm just <laughs> I'm just so used to like especially Dreamers. being in school and being by myself and I'm always like chilling and I don't like 
I don't know. I just I, I, know kinda, I understand you honestly because like some people once they're together in the womb with you, like their energy mm -hmm. infect you. It infect you. So I don't obviously you don't know who you're gonna get in the womb. So you kinda like Yeah, exactly. So I literally was saying like I'm gonna get next the semester that's coming up in august i'm gonna get a room by myself but like i was still worried about it and i tried and I to get my to. yeah and i tried to get my friend to like get it with me but then she's not going to the school and like i even contacted them and i called them and i'm like um am i able to get a room by myself they're like no unless you have a doctor's no like a, a um um uh, some kind of disease no, or something yeah, same to like where you have to have the room by yourself and i was like okay and then and like a few like a week i got it's, an yeah, email I, and they're like no it was a couple of days because i literally. remember we were in the car and then after like two days mm -hmm. you text me you were just you sent me the screenshot of it and i was just like oh, and i got an email see? and they're like oh you have this room and then they told me the price and then they told me the room and they're like if i accept it i could just um go on my school website and accept the offer I was like, what the heck? Like, you know, yeah. it's this shit is really real. Like, yo, everybody mm -hmm. should start manifesting. And it's not like you have to start manifesting. You just have to think positive. And like, whatever you want, you don't have to manifest like us. Like, now I got a notebook to where I write everything down that I want. I because have, I like, feel like two of these it's, in the past few years. <laughs> because I feel like it's good to keep track of it now. Now that I'm more into it and like I'm working on my um, yeah, it's always good to like but write down your gratitude and mm -hmm. then write down your goal every day, even just one goal that you Honestly, want to achieve for the day. I feel like write it's it good down. overall. You know, yeah. If you don't want to write it down, you have a note on your mm -hmm. phone, so just just write it on yeah but i was just then, trying like, to look onto it like later that day and, like you don't have to write it you just have to know like whatever you want is what you're you gonna can, get yeah. so when you want something do not think of the opposite of what you don't want and put your all energy in it because that's yeah. what messed because the up. yeah the minute you start and, thinking oh i don't want this to mm -hmm. happen i don't want don't even think about it the minute you put the don't on the universe don't know the like don't between one so the minute you say don't, that's all the universe mm -hmm. hearing. Like, you, you're saying, like, okay, I don't want this to happen. I don't want this. For the like, universe, you're saying, like, oh, I want this to happen. I want this to happen. Mm -hmm. So just don't do that. Like, as an example, if you don't want this book, right? You say, I don't want the book. The universe don't know don't. So it's going to be, like, book, 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 book. 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 Yeah, so you you're know? just, like, going to so gonna attract it to you. If you do want the book, just say book. Like, you could say, I want the book. So you will get the book. But... If you don't want something and you keep just the don't, yeah. you will get it because it's so confusing. At it first. is, co yeah. I when but. I first started reading this book, I, I had to take it really, really slow, yeah, because hey, like, I couldn't read it that fast because mm -hmm. I had to process everything they were saying. Like even still nowadays, I'd be going back to it and read it again and take notes. Whenever I start reading it, every time, like I find something new and then like I understand it better. So take it easy. Yeah, literally. You could start just by thinking positive and all the things you don't want, you don't think about them. Because yeah. there's so many things, there's so many examples. And it's, y'all need to use Y'all <laughs> yep. just need to manifest. Manifest everything you want because you literally can get any, you could get a million dollars right, right now. now. Yes, you know? Bro, ju and you just ask for it, be patient, believe you it, will, and it's and yours. I, the only thing that is stopping you is the doubt in your mind. And yeah, I feel like this thoughts. is why, like even if I know I could get everything I want, I don't manifest everything I want because it has to be slow because... I, you have to truly believe it and if i say like right now if i say i'm gonna get a million dollars it's gonna be so hard for me to believe yeah. it and i'm gonna question it and i don't want that so i want to so i be manifest when i'm at the point of receiving and i know that i'm ready to receive it because i know if i manifest something really big it's gonna be so hard for me to believe it yeah so gonna it's not gonna come thing. true yeah so you have to be there so you don't have to manifest like uh like one hundred thousand dollar car right now because then you're gonna be like how am i gonna start get this? slow how am i gonna do this how am i not start you know? slow but start small you know you need to manifest but, things that you are going to believe you are going to know that you have that thing today you okay, have it yeah. right now and if you don't really truly believe it you're not gonna have it and that's why it's so important to manifest when you know you're ready 
and when so you know you already it, have yeah. it and you have a space for it because you can't say you want this but you are doing yeah. everything the opposite like the opposite way you know it's like you're not ready to mm -hmm. receive it yet and the universe can tell when you're not ready to receive it yet yeah once it's your time it's just gonna come to you like mm -hmm. that but once it's not yours yet like if it have to take you five years must believe the universe is gonna wait five years to give it to you yeah. because you cannot wash the universe boom no you're just making yourself looking like a clown <laughs> facts but and then again you could get ready for whatever you want if you want something tomorrow you have to get ready for yeah. it but you really cannot just ask for something when you're not ready to receive it because you're not gonna get it and then you're gonna get mad you're gonna get this and you're not really gonna believe it and then you're gonna attract more negative things because once you start thinking like oh i can't get this i can't do this that's exactly what's gonna happen because that's what you were saying that's what you were attracting you were attracting not being able to get what you desire mm -hmm. honestly okay guys that is all for today's video if this video was on your notification that means you were meant to watch it yes and you were meant to receive it and you were meant to read this book honestly because it's everything really thing. happens for a reason and you are probably attracting positivity in your life and that's so why that's why this probably yeah. pop up on your youtube mm -hmm. so yeah that is all for today's video um we'll do more videos about manifestation yeah i'm planning to do one on my channel too so yeah. stay, stay tuned <laughs> and thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in my next, next video. video bye <laughs>